level up and tier up your battle pass. So, there are two ways that this is the fastest method, and you, you, I mean, I'm sure you can see my the gameplay right now, um, but we're going to be playing uh, Battle Royale or um, Warzone, if you want to call it that. But there are two reasons the fastest way to tier up the battle pass. So, Warzone, as you see, or as most of you know, um, gives you a lot of XP for playing a single match, which could be 10 to 20 minutes, so it could either be, well actually it could be 5 to 20 minutes, depending on how early you die, but it could be half the time of the map, or of a match, or it could be double the time of the match, depending um, on your circumstances. But basically the reason why Warzone is the best reason to level up is because there are two factors um, that go into the battle pass. Time, as well as XP. So in the, in the Black Ops Pass for Black Ops 4, it was only time. Um, if I correctly, that went into the battle pass, not XP. But in Warzone, or in uh, Modern Warfare, it is time and XP. So, that helps us out a little bit here. Especially because you can get 40,000 XP, which you would get off. from about one or two games of um, multiplayer. Sometimes with double XP, you would get that amount. You can get up to um, 40k from one game of Warzone pretty easily. And especially with there being 150 people, the higher placing you get, the more XP that you get. So if you place top 30 and get like two kills, you're getting 130,000 XP um, ballparking. Um, so that is one of the main reasons that this is um, good is because the amount of XP that you get. The second reason is the amount of time that you can play the game. So playing Warzone, each match, like I said earlier, could be 5 to 20 minutes. So if you play it multiple times, or if you just go AFK and like move your controller um, to make it move by itself, uh, basically laying it up um, right, lads, on its sticks it so it'll move by itself Hostile and turn by itself, the the then you are, you're not guaranteed not to get kicked for an inactivity, but you are less likely to get kicked for an activity. I've used this a couple times, and I've gotten a pretty hefty amount of XP. Um, you will eventually die by the storm, but for example, I did that for um, one game because I had to uh, go do a couple things, go do a couple chores and stuff. And I did that for one game, and I got, I believe, around 30,000 XP because I hadn't died yet. And then I died, like, probably right as I walked in the room. I'm like, oh, that's a bummer. I died. Um, guess I'm going to have to start the next game. Check out the XP. 30,000. Right there. Pretty easy. Um, as well. Because, I mean, 30,000 XP with no kills. Um, I think I got, like, top 50 of them. So that's probably the reasons I actually just died here. Um, another good reason that Warzone is probably one of the best the that you can play at um, right with to get X or to get battle pass free is because of the pre-game lobby. So unlike Fortnite, you can actually kill people in the pre-game lobby, and these kills actually give you XP towards both your level and your battle pass. So if you're actually playing during the um, pre-game lobby that'll you help you out with your battle pass as well. as well um but yeah those are really the two main things that you want to level up your battle pass number one time warzone helps out with that because you can get anywhere from a five minute to a 30 minute game depending on how long you last sometimes even 35 or 40 if you somehow it takes the game that long to end um and you're one of the last people the second reason is xp xp pulls a pretty decent uh role in the battle pass as well this uh year so Warzone giving you a pretty good amount of XP just for playing the actual match, as well as a decent amount of XP for the pre-game lobby in order to get a couple kills and stuff, are pretty good. Um, I mean, helps it helps out a pretty decent amount. Um, plus, you also get XP for like winning Gulag matches and stuff like that, but... That's really it, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. I'll probably uh, give you a little bit of uh, a snippet, uh, clip, or whatever you want to call it. 
of me getting a couple kills in the free game lobby just to show you guys how much XP we get. But yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, please hit the like button and consider subscribing. Um, I upload every day, whether it's Modern Warfare, Mortal Kombat, and other things like that. Um, Modern Warfare, Mortal Kombat, Fortnite. Um, that's really it. Uh, but yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Okay guys, so I'm back here, um, gonna be showing you guys a little bit of like the XP and stuff that you get from this basic little menu. As you saw on um, the last clip where I basically explained everything, I guess not clip, the last uh, 7 minutes where I basically explained everything, um, it shows me uh, getting to basically top 131 and I got 3000 experience, yeah, so if I could actually get a kill now, there we go. 115, I believe, just for that single kill. And then I died. So yeah, you get about anywhere from 115 to like 200 per kill. So it's kind of like a uh, multiplayer. But also, 